Can I have money for a gym membership? Will you become John Cena by going to the gym? Am I becoming Einstein by going to school? Do you admit that you broke into the same shop three times? Yes. Could you please tell the court what you stole? I stole a dress, your honor. Just one dress? But you admitted to breaking in three times. Yes, I did, your honor. But two of those times was to return the dress that I had took. Why? I don't understand. Because my wife didn't like the design. <laughs> I want you. Hi, mom. I have to tell you about this boy named Justin. Oh, wait. Pizza arrived. Strange. No uniform. Sweetheart, hold on. Let me look at the door camera app. Oh, never mind. I know him. Then she sends a picture. Call 911 now. Calm down. It's just Herb. I'm letting him in. It's not who you think it is. Listen to me. Now we have two choices. Call 911 or let him in and wait. If you guys want to find out what happens next and play a bunch more stories, just click the link on my profile and download the app. Sir, your x-ray showed a broken rib. What? Will I survive? Don't worry. We fixed it with Photoshop. Dad, do you believe in ghosts? Of course not. Ghosts don't exist. But the maid said there's ghosts here. Son, pack your bags. Uh, why? We don't have a maid. Sorry, for some reason this item isn't scanning. I guess that means it's free then. <laughs> you looked bored, so I thought I'd give you something to do. Oh, how nice of you. Can I get you anything else today? Yeah, a million dollars. Isn't it just beautiful outside today? I don't know. I've been inside working the whole day. Is this everything? I have a meeting at 2 today. Yup. Yeah. How are you gonna pay today? <laughs> Yesterday was at the park. I was just... Sir? Card. Do you want the receipt with you or in the bag? And then after that I just have to... Sorry, I'm at the ball right now. Uh, have a nice day. That's what I'm saying. Alright, I'm leaving. Stop making fun of me. Make me! I'm sorry, but your mom already made that mistake. Today was the worst, man. I know, man. Mine too. My little brother got hit by a bus. Oh, man. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. What was bad about your day? I got fired today from my job as a bus driver. <gasps> oh, uh... Is there a problem, officer? Ma'am, you are speeding. Oh, I see. Can I see your license, please? I'd give it to you, but I don't have one. You don't have one? I lost it four years ago for drunk driving. I see. Can I have your vehicle registration papers, please? I can't do that. Why not? I stole this car. Stole it? Yes, and I killed the owner. You what? His body's in the trunk. I need backup. Ma'am, could you step out of your vehicle, please? Is there a problem, sir? One of my officers told me that you stole this car and murdered the owner. Murdered the owner? Yes, could you please open the trunk? Is this your car? Yes, here are the registration papers. My officer claims you don't have a license. Here it is. My officer said you don't have a license, stole the car, and murdered the owner. I bet that liar told you I was speeding, too. What's the chemical formula for water? H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O. What are you talking about? Yesterday, you said it's H-2-O. Why didn't you come to school yesterday? I was sick. You're lying. Nope, I was sick of you and this school. Did you do your chores? No, not yet. I'll do them after I finish this game. That's it. Give me your controller right now. I'm taking this for a month. Now go do your chores before I take something else away. Gerald, did you do your chores yet? My name's Connor. I know I haven't yet. Can I do them after I finish this show? Oh yeah, whatever. As long as they're done by the end of the day. Sweetie, did you do your chores yet? No, I'm too busy playing a game on my phone. You know what, my little angel? It's okay. I'll go do them myself because I don't want you to hurt yourself before your baseball game in four months. Son, why are you home from school so early? I was the only one to answer the question in class. My son's a genius. What was the question? It was who put the trash can on the teacher's head. Mom, look what I got on my report card. Oh. You got one A minus and the rest A pluses. I thought I raised you better! You should have studied harder! Look what I got on my report card. Who are you? Your son? Oh yeah. What'd you get? I got all A pluses. Oh. Cool. Mommy, look what I got on my report card! Good job, honey. I'm so proud of you. You passed one class. Let's go for dinner to celebrate. You must be exhausted. Why? Because you've been running through my mind all day. Oh! What's your name? Shakim Washim. 
That name sounds familiar. Oh, I remember. It was next to the word gorgeous in the dictionary. Oh. Nice. <laughs> no. I'd like to buy some perfume for my wife's birthday. Okay, well, this one is our best seller. And how much is it? It's $50. That's a bit too much. Do you have anything cheaper? We have this one for $30. Ah, that's still too much. Ah, this one's $15. Ah, what I mean is I'd like to see something really cheap. Well, then here. <gasps> Holy crap, I just fell off the 50-foot ladder. Oh my god, are you okay? Yeah, it's a good thing I fell off the first step. <laughs> You. How much longer? Just ten more seconds, you got this. What about now? Nine more seconds. What about now? Eight more seconds. How about now? Fifteen more seconds. What? I'm gonna try to hold my breath for a minute, so start the timer now. <gasps> How long was I under? Uh, 3.2 seconds. Mom, I'm gonna bring Bobby with me and we're gonna go eat dinner, okay? Alright, sounds good with me. Just make sure he takes care of you. Don't worry, Mommy, we'll be good. Come on, let's go. Have fun. So, what are we gonna eat? Mmm, do you wanna order pizza slices? Sure, why not? It is Friday, after all. Hey guys, what's for dinner? Oh, hey! Your brothers went out for dinner, so your dad and I decided to order pizzas for ourselves. Well, what about me? Alright, so this is going to be your workspace right here. And is that the fire alarm? Yes, it is. We better get out of here. Oh, and you know the drill, right? Yeah. Hi, it's nice to see you again. Yeah, same to you. This hotel sucks. Why? What's wrong? Last night, I got no sleep. Every 15 minutes, this loud banging noise woke me up. Oh, I'm so sorry. How was your guys' stay? Terrible! The guy in the room beside us was snoring so loud that we had to bang on the wall every 15 minutes to wake him up. Do <gasps> you know the difference between right and wrong? Yes, I do. Alright, if I reached into a man's pocket and took his wallet with all his money, what would I be? You'd be his wife. <gasps> hey, do you want to play a game? Sure, what game? Any game you want besides hide and seek. What? Why not? Because it's impossible to find a girl like you. <gasps> Didn't you promise to be a good boy? Yes, I did, Mother. And didn't I promise to punish you if you weren't? Yes, Mother. But since I broke my promise, you don't have to keep yours. <gasps> normal looking photos with disturbing backstories. This looks like a normal picture at first. But if you look on the left, you could see a hand around the girl that doesn't belong to any one of them. People believe this is the hand of a ghost because the picture was taken near a haunted house. This picture was taken in 1998, a few minutes before the red vehicle on the right had a bomb explode inside of it. Luckily, the father and son survived, but the person taking the picture didn't. In 1975, these two brothers took a picture because their hair was sticking up. A few seconds later, lightning struck and another hiker died. The boy survived, but one of them got third degree burns and later took his life. Can I borrow your phone to call my girlfriend? Your phone's a genius. What I... Your phone's a genius. When I put in her number, it showed up... Oh. Your phone's a genius. When I put in her number, it said calling girl... girl. Your phone's a genius. When I put in her number, it said calling girlfriend. You Who are you? Time. You. you know Not me. I you. Yes, I am you. Mind. Are you deaf? You know no, you is blind. I'm not blind. You are blind. That's what I just said. <laughs> how did you get two plus two wrong? I don't know. You're stupid, that's how. I'd slap you, but that would be animal of you. <laughs> I want to break up with you. What? You'll never meet anyone else like me! Yeah, that's the whole point. <laughs> no, I know. 
secret hotels don't want you to know. The free breakfast they offer isn't really free. The cost of the breakfast is included in the room's rate. The people who work in housekeeping only straighten the sheets and arrange the pillows. They only wash them if there's a visible stain. Booking a room is more expensive at night because that's when most people are looking for reservations. The ideal time to call the hotel is between 5 and 6 p.m. Because at night they increase their prices because they know there's not many other options. Tipping the staff can give you a lot of benefits, such as deeper cleaning in your room, a special treatment, improvements in your room, and in general, better service. Five-star hotels know your social status before you arrive and will give more attention to famous or wealthy people. And lastly, everything is negotiable. Hotels will always be open to negotiating a few things so you stay and leave a high review. Hello. Hi. Can I try drawing you in 10 seconds? Sure. All right, I just need you to count down from 10. This isn't a joke, I'm actually going to try. All right, ready? Yeah. 10, 9... Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right. Zero. Are you ready? Yes. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. Hey, get some medications for hiccups, please. Ow! What did you do that for? Well, you don't have hiccups anymore, do you? I never had hiccups. My wife does. <gasps> Man was home alone when he heard on the news the description of a murderer that was on the loose. He looked through his glass window and seen a man standing there in the snow. He matched the profile of the murderer exactly and was smiling at him through the window. He immediately picked up his phone and dialed 911. He went back to the window and noticed the man was much closer now. He dropped his phone in shock when he noticed there was no footprints in the snow. Then he realized it was just his reflection the whole time. If you want more creepy stories like that, just download the app on my profile. I'm afraid I can't let your elephant in here, sir. Oh, I assure you, he's very well behaved. All right, then, if you say so. I'm very surprised. Your elephant was well-behaved, and he even seemed to enjoy the movie. Yeah, I was surprised, too. He hated the book. Are these plates clean? They're as clean as cold water can get them. Just eat your meal. Are you sure these plates are clean? I told you before, those dishes are as clean as cold water can get them. Grandpa, your dog keeps growling at me. Cold water, come here. <laughs> Sir, stop running right now! I can't run any longer. I'm out of breath. Sounds like you need arrest. I'm arresting you for illegally downloading the entire Wikipedia. Wait, I can explain everything. <gasps> Anyone that thinks they're stupid, stand up. So you think you're stupid? No, I just felt bad that you were standing alone. <gasps> Do you think you could come in on Sunday? I know you like your weekends off, but I really need you here. Yeah, of course. I'll probably be late, though, because public transport is a bit slow on the weekends. Ah, thank you so much. When do you think you'll be here? Monday? <gasps> I wanted to say I like you. Do you like me? No. Oh. You never asked if I love you. Aww. Do you love me? No. <laughs> I bought this lie detector, so if you lie, it'll be okay? So, you were at school today, right? Yeah. Okay, okay, I was at the movies. Alright, I went for a beer with my friends. What? When I was your age, I never would have touched alcohol. <laughs> he really is your son. <laughs> I want to surprise my girlfriend for Valentine's Day, so I got her these chocolates and a present, and now I'm going to invite her over. But first, I have to make my room look nice and romantic. So I opened up the Govi app and turned on all my lights. Then I went to the Govi light studio and picked out my favorite scene on the Valentine's Day page. Now that my room's all ready for her to come over, I opened up my messages to text her and realized I don't even have a girlfriend. Why aren't you married? Can't you find a girl that'll be a good wife? Actually, I found lots of girls that I want to marry, but when I bring them home, my mother doesn't like them. I've got the perfect solution. Find a girl that's just like your mother. Did you find the perfect girl? Did your mother like her? Yes, I found the perfect girl. She was just like my mother, and you were right. My mom liked her. Then what's the problem? My father doesn't like her. Hey taxi, how much will it cost for you to drive me to the Super 8? Just ten dollars. And how much for my bag? Oh, you don't have to pay for the bags. Okay, take my bag and I'll meet you there. <laughs> well, I'm no artist, but I'll try my best. Look who decided to show. Can someone tell me what they wrote? Remember, there are no bad ideas. How many times do I need to tell you guys? Put your name on the paper! Jeez! <laughs> hey, if I wanted to hear animal noises, I would go to the zoo. Now be quiet!
Has anyone seen my coffee? How am I supposed to help you if I can't read your writing? I wish I could help, but I can't even read it. No, you can't go to the bathroom. But my mama said if I have to go to the bathroom, I could just walk out. I don't care what your mom says. This is my classroom, and I said no. Yesterday, I seen my girlfriend going into the movie theater with another guy. Did you go in after them? No. Why not? Because I already seen the movie. That was Justin! Why is Justin's number on your burner phone? What's going on? I promise I'll explain everything when all of this is over. All of what is over? What are you involved in? And how do you know my boyfriend? We've literally been dating for two weeks. I know. I'm the one who made sure you two met. What does that even mean? Why? Because I needed someone to protect and watch out for you. Like a bodyguard? Who the heck are you? You'll understand. Right now you need to tell me where Herb is. I don't know! I'm currently freaking out that my mom sent me up with a fake boyfriend. I'm sorry, honey. I need to find out the truth. Okay, I'm asking Herb myself. Ten minutes later. Honey, are you okay? Herb just showed me a picture. She sends the picture. Oh my god. Don't worry, honey. It's going to be okay. I've got this covered. And that's the end of the story. But if you want more just like that, then click the link on my profile to download the app. Babe, am I pretty or ugly? Both. What do you mean? You're pretty ugly. <laughs> I finally get it. Get what? You know how when things get hot they expand? Yeah. So I'm not fat, I'm hot. If you can make me laugh, I'll PayPal you one cent. I... no. What about a dollar? Oh, oh, I don't know, that's a big bank. Mm -hmm. Um, no. What about two? No. Three? It's not worth my time. Five dollars. Take it or leave it. What can I get with five dollars? You could get a Big Mac. I could. I definitely could. Alright, try. Okay. Um, I, I don't know. No joke, send it. Why? Because I sent you the money. You made me laugh. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. You actually sent me the <laughs> Why? It's Christmas. Whoa, why is your nose swollen? I sniffed a rose. What? There isn't even a bee in rose. There was in this one. Oh. Here's the dark theory about Bikini Bottom. The Reddit user Catmaster pointed out that Bikini Bottom is named like that because it's directly under Bikini Atoll, which is where they did nuclear testing from 1946 to 1958. And because of this, the creatures that were living in that area have mutated and that's why they can talk. Another Reddit user said that chipmunks were among the animals kept on the Navy ship during these tests. And that's why Sandy wears a full protection suit and turns into a strong creature during hibernation. Luke! Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> oh, so you've been on your phone the whole time, huh? What? No! Hey, I'd like you to do the dishes. My friend right here, she's single and she thinks you're really hot. Thank you. I rate you a 9 out of 10. Why not 10 out of 10? Because I'm the one she needs. Okay. <laughs> Are you a camera? No. Wait, why? Because every time I look at you, I smile. <laughs> do you have a pencil nearby? Yeah, why? Because I want to erase your past and write our future. And that's a good one. Who is Alexander the Great? I don't know, ma'am. You need to focus more on your studies. Who are Brayden, Eric, and Jesse? How would I know? You need to focus more on your daughter. <gasps> Here's the dumbest things bought by billionaires. Saudi Prince Amir bought a Mercedes covered in 300,000 diamonds. It took 13 experts two weeks to attach them and it cost 4.8 million dollars. Data Fugue bought a shirt made entirely out of gold. It has over 14,000 pieces of 22 karat gold weighing 7 pounds. And it cost him $250,000. Finally, Kanye West spent just under a million dollars on four gold-plated toilets for his mansion. I took my medicine at 6 o'clock today. Why? I told you to take them at 9. I know, but I wanted to surprise the bacteria. Hello? Wrong number! Hello? Okay, so that's one with cheese and one with pepperoni. You can pick it up in 20 minutes. Who was that? I don't know, but I took his order, so now we can sleep. Are you okay? Help me! What happened to you? Call me an ambulance! Okay, thank you! Hey, an ambulance! What happened to you?
Requesting permission to ask a question is asking a question without permission. Desperado. Go to bed, you'll feel better in the morning is the human yeah, version of yeah. saying, did you turn it off and back on again? When we sleep, our brain makes up stories and then gets scared of them. Answers to three questions about planes you've always wanted to ask. Why don't they have the same seatbelts as cars? For shoulder straps to work, it has to be attached to something sturdy like a car frame. And airplane walls aren't equipped for that. If they were, it would make the plane heavier, making it burn more fuel. Plane seatbelts have lift lever buckles, making it stronger, and so you can't accidentally open it. Why do planes have red and green lights on their wings? The red light is always on the left wing, and the green light is always on the right wing. This way, other pilots and traffic control can tell which way the plane is flying. The two different colors also make it less likely for the plane to be confused with something like a drone. Why are the windows round? Rounded corners help distribute stress, reducing the chance of it breaking. Square windows are dangerous because the sharp angles are easy to crack because of air pressure. How much would you sell your horse for? I'd sell it to you for $2,000. 2000 Deal. Perfect. You can come and pick him up tomorrow. Hey, I'm here to pick up the horse. I have some bad news. Unfortunately, the horse passed away. <sighs> you know what, it's fine. Just give me my money back. I can't do that. I already spent it all. Okay, then give me the dead horse. Why? What are you going to do with it? I'm going to raffle it off. You can't raffle off a dead horse. Of course I can. I just won't tell anyone that it's dead. Hey man, what happened to the dead horse? Did you end up raffling it off? <laughs> I sure did. I sold 500 tickets for $25 each and made a total of 25000 Did anyone complain? Just the guy that won. So I gave him his money back. <gasps> oh my god! You're a TikToker! What? How's it I going? I follow you, dude! Yo, I follow you! <laughs> How's it going? Bro, do the face, do the face! <laughs> what the heck? Can I tell you a joke? Yes. Knock knock. Who's there? A little old lady. A little old lady who? I didn't know you could yodel! Oh. Oh. A little old lady. Are you gonna post this on TikTok? I don't know, can I? Please? Okay, maybe. I may, I might, I might. Yeah, I'll be on, I'll watch your account. Alright, you'll be on okay, the lookout. Okay, bye! people who won the food lottery. This person found a mini orange inside of their big orange. This vending machine had an error and distributed everything for the price of one item. This person found a green pepper growing inside of a red pepper. This person got a carton full of double yolk eggs. Now before I tell you the craziest one about this bacon, I found this app that lets you prank your friends and family by changing their text messages. Just press this button on my profile if you want to try it too. This person ordered bacon from Five Guys, but since he was their last customer before closing, they gave him the rest of their bacon for free. I'm gonna break my dad with this empty toilet paper roll. I'm just gonna get it a little wet. Now I'm just gonna crumple it up. Now I'm just gonna set it right beside the toilet. So when he walks into the bathroom, this is what he sees. Now I just gotta wait until he gets home. He's just backing into the garage, now I just gotta wait until he goes to the bathroom. Just wondering why the door is closed. <laughs> oh my god. You ask. No, why can't you ask? Just ask. No, you ask. Fine. Hey, my friend wants to ask you something. Can you give me back my controller tomorrow? Yeah, sure. Okay, but don't forget. I won't forget. So, did you bring it? Bring what? Oh. This is my favorite part of the movie. Spider-Man's about to die. Seriously? Guess what? The funniest thing happened today. And what were you going to say? I got a concussion. Did you actually? How? A flower pot fell from your apartment building this morning when I was coming to visit you and hit me on the head. What were you going to tell me? Oh, well I was going to tell you my mom's flower pot fell and hit someone on the head this morning. <gasps> I made you some cereal for dinner. Hey, what do you say? Oh, uh, thank you, I guess. You guess? No, 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 I, uh, thank you, okay? Thank you. Yeah, that's what I thought. <sighs> Where's my food? Did I hear something? Huh. Must have been a bug. Here you go, sweetie. This is disgusting. Oh, I'm so sorry, baby. What do you want me to make you? Um, can I have... You know what? Here's some money. Get in the car. We're going to McDonald's. Hey, Nathan, can you fix my computer? So what was wrong? It was an ID10T error. An ID10T you know error? What is that, in case I have to fix it again? Haven't you heard of an ID10T error before? You know no. Write it down and I think you'll figure it out. Until I make you mine. <gasps> 
strangest things found on beaches. In 2016, thousands of snowballs were found on a beach in Siberia. It's said that they were formed from wind and cold weather. It's the first time something like this has ever happened and probably the last. If you've ever thought about sending a message in a bottle, somebody already did 101 years ago. A German fisherman found a message and actually managed to get it to the daughter of the sender. Although it looks like something out of a movie, a robotic hand was found on a beach near New York and no one really knows where it came from. And if that one wasn't strange enough, a dinosaur bone was found on a beach in Washington. Scientists analyzed it and said it could be from a T-Rex or a Velociraptor, and it's estimated to be around 80 million years old. And finally, the creepiest one of all. Between 2007 and 2008, multiple feet were found still in shoes on the beaches in Canada. In total, seven feet were found and there's still no explanation. So hot outside. Yeah, I know. <gasps> I have an idea. What is it? Let's walk down to the store and get some ice cream. Yes, let's do it. Hey man, remember when we were younger and we used to always finish each other's sentences? Yeah, those were the good old days. Why do you ask? Well... I'm wondering if we could do that again. I love you. I love you too. Prove it. Tell the world that you love me. I love you. What? I said tell the world. You are my world. It's two flowers plus two flowers. Four flowers? Very good. Now it's 2,563 flowers plus 8,922 flowers. A garden? <gasps> Words can't even describe how beautiful you are. Aww, thank you. But numbers can. Funniest ways people got revenge. When Mark's laptop was stolen from him, he hacked into it from his house and found an embarrassing video of the thief dancing in front of the camera. He then uploaded it to YouTube where it went viral and the thief saw it. So he returned the laptop begging for Mark to take the video down, but he didn't. When a girl found out her boyfriend had cheated on her, she asked him to get matching tattoos as a symbol of love, which he agreed to. But she left him without getting hers, leaving him with a tattoo to remind him of her. This guy was just doing his job painting over some graffiti, but I guess the people who painted it weren't too happy with him. They got revenge by painting him on the wall where he had just covered up. Who here would like a $20 bill? I'm gonna give this $20 bill to one of you, but first let me do this. Who wants it? Well, what if I do this? Who wants it now? You've all learned a valuable lesson. No matter what I did with this money, it doesn't lose its value. It's still worth $20. Many times in life we're crumpled, dropped, and ground into the dirt by the decisions we make. But no matter what happens, you'll never lose your value. You're special. Don't ever forget it. Duh. I want you. secret codes unlock hidden iPhone features. This number makes it so when people call you, it sends them straight to voicemail. And to turn it off, you just type it again. Typing in this makes it so when you phone people, your number won't show up. When you put this followed by somebody's number, your number won't show up only for that one call. Type this in to activate call waiting, which turns this on for when someone calls you when you're already on the phone. To deactivate it, type this. Putting in this lets you check how many missed calls you have. This lets you check the balance of your phone bill. And this tells you how many available minutes you have left. Real life glitches caught on camera. A guy pulled out a camera to take a picture of a bird when he seen this helicopter taking off. The helicopter starts flying but the propellers aren't even moving. A dad was recording his son while he was looking in the mirror. The boy turned around to look at the camera but his reflection in the mirror didn't follow his actions. In 1995 when Mike Tyson was boxing, there was somebody in the crowd recording on a phone. But the thing is, phones with cameras didn't come out until 5 years after this fight. And finally, these people were having a street race on the highway. As soon as the cars passed, you could see a dog in the middle of the highway. It would have been impossible to miss it so it had to have teleported. Workers flight attendants never tell passengers. Even if you ask for regular coffee, they'll give you decaf. Because they prefer you to sleep during the flights because it means less work for them. The water used for tea and coffee isn't the cleanest. It's the same as the water used for toilets as it's pumped from tanks that have probably never been cleaned. Locking yourself in the bathroom often isn't the best idea because it's possible to open them from the outside. And if you're found to be suspicious of anything unusual, you'll be taken to the police when you land. Sea trays are one of the dirtiest things on an airplane because although they clean the plane after all the passengers leave, they don't clean the trays because it would take too long. Oxygen Masks don't provide as much air as you would think. They only provide 15 to 20 minutes, which is just enough time for the plane to land. Deadliest foods people actually eat. Fugu is one of the deadliest dishes out there. In Japan, people usually eat it as a test of bravery, because the toxin in the puffer fish can leave you paralyzed for the rest of your life. Ballad is a food in some Southeast Asian countries, such as the Philippines or Vietnam. People literally eat the duck egg fetus. In Asia, some cultures eat raw monkey brains. Rather than killing you, it could lead you with a severe infection. The brain of an infected monkey can transmit a disease that is uncurable. Casu Marzu is one of Italy's most traditional cheeses. Despite its ban for causing side effects, to make it you set it outside uncovered and allow cheese flies to hatch eggs inside it. The eggs then hatch into maggots which eat away at your stomach.
Babe, do you want to go to a movie with me? Sure, what movie? Killer Sharks. What's it about? It's about a horse that wants to become a singer. My laugh will arrive in four to five business days. Edit. The package got stolen. <laughs> See, those oh. ones make me laugh. This dude speaks as if he's figuring out English each time he opens his mouth <laughs> and is surprised by the sounds slash words that are coming out. It's true. But then, just wait. A couple comments down on the exact same video. I don't know why y'all hate... I don't know why y'all... I don't know why y'all... I can't even read this now because of the last <laughs> comment. <laughs> My password to Luke123, what's yours? Mine is Superman, Batman, Flash, Iron Man, Deadpool, Loki, Thor, Spider-Man. Why is it so long? It had to be at least 8 characters long. Why do you think you deserve a raise? Well, there's three reasons why I want a raise. First, I iron clothes better than you. Who said you iron better than me? Your husband did. Oh, the second reason is that I'm a better cook than you. That's nonsense. Who said you were a better cook than me? Your husband did. Oh. My third reason is that I'm a better lover than you. Did my husband say that? No, the gardener did. <gasps> it says on the menu that you sell fat-free fries, is that true? Yep, 100%. Really? Well then I'll get a large. Okay, it'll only be a minute. Wait a minute, why are the potatoes dripping with oil? I thought you said it was fat-free. It is, you only have to pay for the potatoes. <gasps> Do you know which mouse can walk on two legs? No. Mickey Mouse, and which duck can walk on two legs? Donald Duck? No, every duck can walk on two legs. Is there a problem, officer? Sir, you were speeding. Oh, okay. Can I see your license, please? I would give it to you, but I don't have one. You don't have one? I lost it a few years ago for drunk driving. I see. Can I have your vehicle registration papers, please? I can't give you those either. Why not? I stole this car. Stole it? Yeah, and I killed the owner. You what? His body's in the trunk. I need backup right now! Sir, can I get you to step out of the vehicle, please? Why? Is there a problem? One of my officers told me that you stole this car and murdered the owner. Murdered the owner? Yes. Can you please open the trunk? Yeah, of course. Hmm, I didn't find anything. Is this your car? Yeah, here are the registration papers. My officer also claims that you don't have a license. Here it is. My officer said that you didn't have a license, stole this car, and murdered the owner. I bet that liar told you I was speeding, too. Babe, are you ready? Just wait, I have to do my makeup. You don't need makeup. Aw, really? You need plastic surgery. <laughs> Everyone who plays video games are nerds. I guess I'm a nerd then. I already knew that. Tell me something I don't know, freak. The taste of salad. <gasps> Yo, bro, Jimmy just got married too. So what? Bro, all of our friends are married and have jobs and we're stuck here in the bar. We need to do something. I have an idea. What is it? Let's unfollow them. How was your meal tasting, sir? Can I speak to the manager, please? Of course, just one moment. I heard you wanted to speak to me? Yeah, I wanted to compliment you on your very clean kitchen. Clean kitchen? <laughs> have you seen our kitchen? No, but it must be clean because all this food tastes like soap. <laughs> Where are you going? No. See, that always happens. I didn't like the first one, so I'm gonna do a whole bunch of more takes until I get it, but I'm just gonna show you guys the good takes so the video doesn't take forever. Because even though it's only like a 15, 30 second video, it takes a lot more time than, than you would think. Where are you going? No. Nope. Where are you going, sir? Nope. I have to get it perfect. This, this is why it takes forever. <laughs> Where are you going, sir? That one was better. Go with that one. And then, like I said, I'm going to film all of this character first so I don't have to keep taking off my hoodie. <laughs> it's time to get up and get ready for school. <sighs> Mom, I don't think I can go to school today. <laughs> Just suck it up and go get ready. You're going to make me late for work. But I really don't feel good. <laughs> I'm not buying it. I'll be waiting in the car. Mom? What? I'm not feeling very good. And what do you want me to do about it? Can I stay home today? I don't care, you can walk to school, take the bus, stay in bed, whatever. Just leave me alone. <gasps> My little angel! Is everything alright? Yeah. Oh, you don't look very well. Do you want me to get you some soup? Mom, I'm fine. You know what? I'll call the school right now and let them know you won't be in for the rest of the year, okay? The haircut's $25. I don't know what's worse, your IQ or your hairline. You know what's funny? What? Not you, so shut up. <gasps>
Can you help me in the garden today? What do you think I am? A gardener? Hey, sweetie, can you help me fix the door handle? What do you think I am? A carpenter? <gasps> This is the luckiest man alive. Frayn Selleck was riding a train when it went off the tracks into a river. 17 passengers died, but he was able to swim to shore with nothing but a broken arm. The next year when he was on a plane, a door detached from the aircraft, then it crashed. 19 people died, but Selleck was found in a haystack with a few bruises. In 1996, he was on a bus when it drove into a river. Four people died, but again, he survived. In 1970, his car's fuel tank exploded on the highway. In 1973, his fuel tank leaked and his car caught on fire. Fast forward to 1995 and he was in a another bus crash. The next year when he was driving, a truck came barreling towards him. He jumped out of his vehicle and watched it explode. Better run back over to my house before 12 a.m. I'll see you next year. <laughs> Good one. Hey Luke! What? Why was six afraid of nine on New Year's Eve? I don't know. Why? Because nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! Luke, guess what? What? I haven't showered since last year! <laughs> Dad, how much does it cost to become a doctor? About $100,000, son. How much does it cost to build a house? Almost $300,000. And how much does it cost to get married? I'm not sure. I'm still paying. <gasps> I want you. Here's the dark theory about Mr. Kratz. Since he's the only crab in Bikini Bottom, fans believe that he killed the rest of them to make Krabby Patties. In this episode, when Plankton and Mr. Krabs were fighting over the Krabby Patty secret formula, he accidentally ripped off the part that said crab meat is a secret ingredient. In an episode where Mr. Krabs takes a bite out of a Krabby Patty, he said, Oh, so that's what I taste like. This is why Mr. Krabs was scared when the food inspector came. And they also believe this is why the Krusty Krab is shaped as a crab trap. Dad, how are people born? Adam and Eve made babies, then their babies became adults and had babies, and so on. Mom, how are people born? We were monkeys, then we evolved to become what we are now. You lied to me! No, your mom was talking about her side of the family. <gasps> Here's the dark theory about Timmy Turner. In the show, when kids turn 13, they lose their fairy godparents. So fans believe right before he turned 13, he wished to be a ghost, which turned his whole world into the show Danny Phantom. This is why Timmy looks like Danny, Chester looks like Dash, AJ looks like Tucker, and Trixie looks like Paulina. Do you want to be my partner? No, you're a loser. I may not be perfect, but at least I'm not you. In a million coincidences, these two trucks lined up and said Taylor Swift. This guy took off the mask and looks more like Mario than Mario does himself. The mountains on the truck lined up perfectly with the mountains in real life. These two ladies were dressed up almost the exact same and they're doing the same thing. This news reporter looks the exact same as the robber that's on the loose. Why don't you ever take me to some expensive place? Okay, get ready, we're going. <gasps> Where? To the gas station. Pack your bags, sweetheart. I won $10 million in the lottery. Wow! Now London or Switzerland? Who cares? Just pack your bags and get lost! <laughs> Lucky discoveries that made people rich. A collector bought a painting and when he went to fix the frame, he realized that inside was a piece of paper. But it wasn't just any piece of paper. He found a copy of the United States Declaration of Independence. He bought the painting for $4, but the piece of paper is worth almost $1 million. A man whose hobby is to use a metal detector to search for treasure got really lucky. He found a strange greenish piece with a red engraving, then a chain, and finally a Celtic treasure, which is again worth close to $1 million. As the couple was packing to move to a new house, they found an action comic comic book number one, dated 1938 in one of the boxes in their attic. Only 99 copies of this comic exist and each are sold for 1.5 million dollars. What are your fees? I charge $50 for three questions. That's awfully steep, isn't it? Yeah, I suppose so. Now what's your final question? Son, can you buy me a soft drink? Coke or Pepsi? Coke. Diet or regular? Regular. Bottle or can? Bottle. Eight ounce or liter? Forget it, just buy me a water. Natural or mineral? Mineral. Hot or cold? I'm gonna hit you with a broom. Stick broom or soft broom? You animal! Cow or chicken? Get out of here! Now or later? Now! Are you gonna come with me or not? I'm gonna kill you! With a knife or a gun? Gun! In the head or in the stomach? You pest! Cockroach or rat? Ah!
Secrets movie theaters don't want you to know. Movie theaters earn very little from ticket sales. That's why they decided to lower the cost of tickets and raise the cost of food. So the earnings would go entirely to the movie theater. Food combos won't always save you money. Sometimes it's just a strategy to make you think it's the best option. So next time check if it's better to buy a combo or buy the food separately. Sometimes there's people yelling at the cabin for the movie to start. But what they don't know is that the cabin is completely empty. Thanks to new technology, human assistance isn't needed. Movies will never start at the time the ticket says it will. This way they'll get more people to watch the ads before the movie. And if you ever thought you were cool sneaking into another movie than the one that you bought, the employees don't really care as long as there are seats available. You're gonna pay a big fine for all those fish in your bucket. But officer, these are my pet fish. I bring them here to swim and then they hop back in the bucket. Oh really? This I've got to see. If you can prove it, I'll let you go. Okay, let me put them in the water. So, where are the fish? What fish? I want you to be happier. You have beautiful teeth. You know Aw, thanks. They remind me of a song. Which one? Black and yellow. <laughs> what would you like for Christmas, grandson? I want Fortnite outfits. D did you say Fortnite? Yes, it's a super fun battle royale game. Oh, I know what it is. It's a 2v2, we got. Oh, he's on me, he's on me, he's on me. Come on, let's go, come on. No, come on, where's the last guy? Where is he? Where is he? Oh, he's right here! He's right here! He's on me! He's on me! Oh, yeah, let's go! First victory royale! <laughs> Grandpa, why are you crying? Oh, you don't worry about me. I just heard that Fortnite Chapter 3 is coming out, and I just can't wait to see what Fortnite has planned next. And this is my favorite room. It's the office. Are there any ghosts? Any what? Does the house have any ghosts? Oh, no, of course not. <sighs> Dang it. You want ghosts? It's just, I don't have many friends, and I'm gonna be lonely here by myself, so I'd like some people to talk to. Well, I'm sorry, but there's no ghosts here. Shall we move on to the rest of the house? Excuse me, I'm in the middle of a conversation. Oh. Um, with who? I'll take it. Hello? Honey, it's me. Are you at the golf course? Yeah, why? I'm at the mall. I found a leather coat. It's only a thousand dollars. Can I get it? Sure, go ahead if you really like it. I also stopped by the Mercedes dealership and seen one that I really like. How much is it? 98000 Okay, but for that price, make sure it comes with all the options. Great! Oh, and one more thing. The house that I wanted last year is back on market for 980000 Well, then offer 900000 and they'll probably take it. But if not, offer an extra 50000 if you think it's a good price. Okay, I'll see you later. I love you so much. You're worth it. Bye. Does anybody know whose phone this is? Why can't I go to my friend's house? Because I said so! But all my friends are gonna be there! If they jumped off a cliff, would you do it too? Of course not, that's completely different, this isn't fair! Wait until you get into the real world! Oh, shut up! Did you just say what I thought you said? If you heard me say it, then why are you asking? I know I'm gonna die, and I wanna take my money with me. So I'm gonna give each of you 150,000, and I want each of you to make sure the money gets into my coffin. I can't live with this guilt anymore. I only put a hundred thousand into his coffin. I'm glad you brought that up. I've been feeling guilty too. I only put in eighty thousand. You guys should be ashamed of yourselves for stealing money like that. Am I the only honest person here? Look, I wrote a check for the full hundred and fifty thousand. <gasps> At the end of this ruler, there's an idiot. I have a question. What? In which end? My friend here, Justin, really wants to talk to you, if that's okay. Okay. Okay, I'll go get him. Okay. <laughs> hey, hey. Liz, how's it going? You know who you're Good, how are you? Who? My future girlfriend. <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, do you have an extra heart? Because mine was just taken. Doctor, I'm having a tough time losing weight. What should I do? From now on, I want you to split everything you eat. So, for example, if you want a banana, just have half of it. Okay, I'll give it a try. Thanks. Welcome to the donut shop. What can I get for you? Hi, just one moment, please. So, since the doctor said to split everything, do you want to split a donut with me? I have an idea. Let's split two. <gasps> I'm not feeling very well. Can I talk to you for a minute? Yeah, for sure. I'm afraid he's not gonna make it, unless you treat him like a king and you're at his side 24 hours a day. So what did the doctor say? Well, she said you probably won't make it. 
Luke, if there were five birds sitting on a fence and you shot one with your gun, how many would be left? There would be none. No, the answer is four. No, because the rest would fly away. <coughs> five most funny design fails. This sign says do not enter, but it also says entrance only, so I guess you can't go in or out. In this children's book, it says five bananas, but if you count them, there's actually six. In this lady's bathroom, there's holes cut out in the stall so you could see if anybody's using it. In this bathroom, the paper towel dispenser's right over the sink, so when you go to get paper, it gets wet. Now, before I show you the craziest one, I found this app that tells you your celebrity lookalike, and apparently I look like Marilyn Monroe. Just press the button on my profile to get it. Finally, this person thought they were doing a four-mile run trail, but after they finished the four miles, they realized that it kept going. Hey, Mom, can I- No. I was just asking if I could- No. Hear me out, Mom. I just want- No. <sighs> no. Fine. Hey, didn't I ask you to clean the house today? Well, I tried asking you if you wanted me to clean the dishes, but you said no. Then I tried asking you if you wanted me to back in the house, but you said no again. I even considered doing your laundry, but you just kept saying no. Oh. Can I please? Yes. Yes, you can. Okay, thanks. I'm going out with my friends. I'll be back at 1 a.m. Here's things that are bigger than you thought. Here's how big a traffic light is compared to a human. Here's a polar bear's paw compared to a human hand. Traffic signs are actually really big. Here's a regular sized moose compared to vehicles. Here's how big the Titanic is compared to a modern cruise ship. Here's how big a tornado is compared to a wind turbine. And here's how big the blade of a wind turbine is compared to a human. Would you like to be the sun in my life? Ah, oh, yes. Good, let's stay 92.96 million miles away from me. <laughs> what was that for? I was doing your laundry when I found a piece of paper in your pocket with the name Mary Lou on it. Who is she? Are you cheating on me? Honey, don't worry about it. Remember three weeks ago when I went to the horse race with my friends? Mary Lou was the horse I was betting on. Oh, good. I'm going to continue with the laundry. Ah! What was that for? Your horse call. <gasps> Did you know you have a big nose and you're really fat? Thanks for letting me know. Did I miss something? Yeah, the door out of my life. Coolest houses in the world. This safe house is the only home in the world designed for a zombie apocalypse. When you flip the switch, the mechanical concrete walls and steel doors shut, making it impossible to get in. It even has a drawbridge to get to the pool so you don't have to go downstairs. This house has three floors with built-in slides. One side of the house has stairs to get to each floor, but on the other side, there's a slide that you could ride all the way down to the first floor. The house also has a built-in ball pit. Finally, there's 130 of these floating houses being built in Dubai. The bedroom is on the lowest floor, making it fully underwater. There's huge windows that overlook the coral reef. And on the top floor, there's a bar and hot tub. Are you good at physics? Can you help me? Two elephants were walking together. One was red and one was left-handed. How old is my dog if I like pancakes? Yeah, what's the question? Biggest things ever stolen. A tank from the California army was stolen by an unemployed plumber in 1995. The man destroyed everything in his path as the police chased him for 20 minutes. A beach in Jamaica was stolen in 2008. Police still don't know who did it, but they took sand that corresponds to 500 truckloads of sand. A World War II fighter plane was stolen by an Air Force commander. He restored it and sold it for over $300,000. This 3,000 pound bell was stolen from a Buddhist temple. The bell was only used for special occasions and was priceless to the monks, but it was sold for $500 a year later. And believe it or not, people in Mahatma village in India stole a mountain peak. They worked 11 hours a day to cut the rock. They stole it then sold it so they could feed their families. Secret places hidden in famous locations. In the Eiffel Tower, there's a small apartment built at the top that the designer built for himself. Visitors can buy a ticket to look through the window into his apartment. In London, you could find a secret base in a lamppost located in the famous Trafalgar Square, which is the smallest police station in the world. It was built during the Great Depression of 1929 to control the riots that occurred in the area. The Grand Central Terminal train station has a tennis court hidden in a small space called the Annex. It's been used as a recording studio and even an art gallery, and you could even visit it whenever you want. Andrew Gordon discovered a small hole with a key while exploring Pixar Studios. When he went inside, he found an empty spot and turned it into Lucky 7 Lounge, an area for employees to relax, have a drink, and get some rest. Sis Emily, I have a boyfriend. I found your purse at Starbucks and it had your number on it, so I thought I'd let you know. Oh my goodness, where can I meet you to pick it up? I have a girlfriend. <laughs> I just got 150,000 followers on TikTok. No one asked. If you didn't ask, then why are you listening? Oh, the contestant was running from Nolan? Hey Luke, can I ask you a quick favor? 
He's lucky my What? Is protein Excuse me, miss. I have a question about the video. One second. Let me just quickly pause the video so I can hear you better. Long fibrous chains containing proteins. Bundles of thousands of fibers make up the muscle itself. When an athlete engages in a Okay, what were you gonna ask? Don't stop until I make you mine. I love you. you know I don't love you. Stop Think again. No, no, and no. Waiter, bring separate bills. Oh! Okay, okay, I love you. You All these people on Instagram are rich. Do you wanna know how to make lots of money on Instagram? Yeah, of course. It's really easy. Really? How? Please tell me. Go to your account settings, deactivate your account, and get a job. <laughs> Five most unusual prisons. In Bolivia, San Pedro prison, each prisoner has to pay for their cell. Each one is between $1,000 and $1,500. And to get the money, they have to work. That's why the prison is full of restaurants and small markets. In Norway, there's an eco-friendly prison. Everything is recycled, solar panels are used, and most of the food is produced. The prison actually looks more like a summer camp because you could play tennis, swim, and go horseback riding. The Alcatraz prison was a small island in San Francisco. It's almost impossible to escape because you would have to go through concrete walls, the rocky coastline, and swim through the freezing cold water. In Cebu prison in the Philippines, prisoners dance as part of their exercise program. And there's actually a viral video where they dance to Michael Jackson's Thriller. Finally, there's a prison in Austria that holds prisoners who don't require maximum security. The prisoners even wear their own clothes, cook their own food, and live a fairly normal life. I have the perfect son. Does he drink alcohol? Never. Does he ever come home late? Never. Really? Does he smoke? Never. I guess you really do have the perfect son. How old is he? He'll be six months old next week. <laughs> Son, give me your phone for a minute. Wait, Dad, let me turn it on. You know that I won't stop until I make you mine. Here you go. Thanks, I just wanted to check the time. Three most dangerous airplane landings. On a Myanmar Airlines flight in 2019, the plane lost its front wheels, so they were unable to land. The pilot had to do circles around the landing area to burn fuel so it would slow down the plane and make it easier to land. The plane landed with the rear wheels first, then the nose of the plane hit the ground. Everyone remembers Sully after his emergency landing on the Hudson River. Two geese collided with the engines of the plane to make them stop working, so the pilot had no choice but to try landing in the river, which he did successfully. At an airport in South Sudan, a plane carrying 43 people caught on fire after the wing collided with a car. What happened is the pilot couldn't see the runway because of the heavy fog, so he had to make a blind landing. But fortunately, all the passengers got off safely. Oh, you're the TikToker! You're the TikToker! You're the TikToker, aren't you? You're the TikToker! <laughs> can you follow me? Can you follow me? Can you follow me? Yeah, I can follow you, yeah. <laughs> I, my TikTok is, um, um, oh my god. Do the face, do the face. Oh, do you want to be um, in a TikTok? <laughs> yes, yes. All right. Strangest last meal requests on death row. In 1963, Victor Harry Fager was sentenced to death for a kidnap and murder. For his final meal, he requested a single olive with the seed left in it. After his execution, the seed was found in his pocket. They believe he wanted to be buried with it so a tree would sprout on top of him. Gerald Lee Mitchell requested an assorted bag of Jolly Ranchers and he ate every single one. Now before I tell you the craziest one, I found this app that boosts your snap score and makes your Snapchat look like this. If you want to try it, just press the button on my profile. In 1990, James Edward Smith requested a lump of soil. But because dirt isn't on the list of permitted food, he was served a cup of yogurt instead. Dad, I don't want to go to school tomorrow. Son, when Abraham Lincoln was your age, he used to walk 12 miles to go to school. That's great, but you know what, Dad? What is it? When he was your age, he became the president of USA. Hey. I know you want me. Yeah, I want you to leave. Doctor, I want to lose weight. What should I do? Do you want my camera? What about my iPhone 12 Pro Max? What about my Lamborghini? What about a hundred million dollars? Congrats, you're skinny now. Are you from Tennessee? No. Because you're the only 10 I see. I think there's something wrong with my eyes. Really? Why? I can't take them off you. Do you have a map? A map? Yeah. Why? Because I keep getting lost in your eyes. <laughs> okay, I'll give you that one. <laughs> I have something very serious to tell you. Really? What is it? According to DNA test results, that isn't our kid. You don't remember, do you? Remember what? When we were leaving the hospital, we noticed our baby had a dirty diaper, so you told me to go and change the baby. <gasps> we're gonna rob the bank fast, okay? Okay, but why do I have a camera? 
Just in case the police show up, we'll tell them it's a prank. This man almost died on a water slide and it was caught on video. David Salmon was on a private water slide in Texas when he flew 10 to 15 feet onto rocks and survived with a broken arm and fractured ribs. Here's the video. And speaking of falling off water slides, I've been playing this super addicting game where you try to hit players off the water slide and be the first one down. If you want to play it, just click this link on my profile, press water slide game, then download it for free, and let me know in the comments if you beat the first level on your first try. Son, if you study today, I'll buy you a phone. Okay, Dad, I'll go right now. I finished. I lied. Me too. I wish I was cross-eyed. Why? So I could see you twice. <laughs> you know what you'd look good in? What? My arms. <laughs> that was good. Thank you. I thought happiness started with an H. It does. Mine starts with you. Oh. Do you know how to solve this? You know no, I don't. Okay, I'll erase it. Mine, until I make you mine. Until I make you mine. Hey, can you do the dishes, please? All of them? Yes, all the dishes. But all I did is put one cup in. Don't make me ask you again. Okay, okay, fine. Hey, who are you? I'm your son. Get out of my house before I call the cops. Let me take that from you, honey. Is there anything else I can do? Can you make me a peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Coming right up. This sad story might make you cry. A lady wanted a ring, but the guy gave her a teddy bear instead. The lady was frustrated, so she threw the teddy bear onto the road. The guy went to go get it, but he was hit by a coming car and died. At his funeral, the lady was hugging the bear, and she heard a machine inside it say, Will you marry me? She then opened it up and found a ring inside. Three weirdest restaurants in the world. Cafe Econ is a three-story restaurant. The first floor is normal, but the second and third floor are filled with ankle-deep water and swimming fish. One floor has smaller fish than the other, so you could choose which one you'd like. Guests have to take off their shoes before entering. In the restaurant called Modern Toilet, the chairs are replaced with toilets and the food is shaped like this. An example of a meal you could order is called a turd sub sandwich. This restaurant is prison themed. Guests are brought to their table by a prison guard. Each table is in a different cell blocked off by big black bars. The prison guards carry fake guns and there's also fake guns on the walls and ceiling. Lawyers hope you get sued, doctors hope you get sick, cops hope they are a criminal, mechanics hope you have car troubles but only a thief wishes you success. When you say forward or back, your lips move in those directions. We've woken up thousands of times but we're still not used to it. Mom, we're gonna be late for my soccer game. You know, your generation has no patience. When I was your age, if I was standing at the door like you are, my mom would be yelling at me that I'm not helping her with the dishes. Ah! Come on, you stupid computer! I don't have all day! Dinner's ready. Okay, I'll be there in like 30 seconds. No! You're gonna turn it off and come eat right now! Five? Okay, okay! Mom, is dinner almost ready? Oh, shoot. We just finished eating. Sorry, I forgot to come and tell you that it was ready. Dinner's ready! Okay, I just need to finish this game, then I'll come. Of course, honey. You can come whenever you're ready. You know what? I'll bring you your food so you can continue playing. Okay, class, we're gonna start by sharing our dreams. What's yours, Luke? My dream is to earn a million dollars per year like my dad. Wow, your dad earns that much? No, that's also my dad's dream. <gasps> Should I get in trouble for something that I didn't even do? No. Good, because I didn't do the homework. Parents be like, go to your parents be like, go to your chores or I'm taking your phone. Parents be like, go to your chores or I'm taking your phone. No. Parents be like, go to your chores or I'm taking your phone. Then do it. Okay then. Hey, I was just joking. <laughs> but when you're running, try to hold the phone like this so uh, it looks like you're behind me and me. Like so it, you, they can see you. Okay. okay. Parents be like, go to your chores. No, <clears throat> too fast. Parents be like, go to your chores or I'm taking your phone. Then do it. Okay then. Hey, I was just joking! Try to sound just a bit more aggressive. Okay, well yeah, first of all it was too. Yeah. Like hold on. Okay then. Okay, but a bit slower. But same do try one more time. Same tempo but or a bit slower, same volume. Hey officer, my wife is missing. She went out yesterday and she never came home. Okay, stay calm, sir. What's her height? <sighs> um
maybe like 5'5", five, five, no, 5'7", five, 5'6", five, I'm not too sure. She's shorter than me. Okay, what's her weight? I have no clue. Um, She's not really slim, but she's not really big. What about her eye color? I think they're green. Wait, no, brown. Actually, I don't know. I, re I never really looked that close. What color's her hair? Uh, I'm not too sure. She just went to a new hairdresser, so it changed. Okay, what was she wearing when you last saw her? She was wearing a blue dress. Or were those jeans? Or maybe she was wearing shorts. I don't know. <sighs> Did she take a vehicle when she left? Yes, she took my vehicle. And would you happen to know the brand? Yes, it's a 2022 Black Sport Appearance Ford F-150 Lariat 5 liter V8 engine with 400 horsepower and 400 torque stock. But I installed a 3 liter Whipple supercharger, so now it has 775 horsepower and 685 torque. It has a max trailer tow package, so it has a big 136 liter gas tank, black leather seats, power deployable running boards, twin moonroof, FX4 off-road package with skid plates, Bang & Olufsen Unleashed 18 speakers sound system, 360 cameras, blue cruise so it could drive itself, power tailgate, 2000 watt generator built in the bed, 3.73 electric lock rear axle, upgraded all-terrain tires, 20 inch 5 spoke dark alloy wheels, and it also has a Borla Attack exhaust with black chrome tips, and unfortunately one of them has a dent in it from a rock. Don't worry sir, we'll find your vehicle. <laughs> Thank you.